Yeah. Very tidy duck. I've just spoken to the man in road radio. He knows the guy personally. He's um, bought or is going to buy the property. I think he's bought it. And his intention is to keep it as close as possible to how it is now. Good on you. We love people like you. I wish I wasn't so fat I could get through that gap. But this is for the Wally family. It needs some repair. All that shrubbery is gone. Everything's gone, look. Right. So, it's a bit of rubbish still. There's a little window. It's a bit broken. It's a little sink. Someone's got a towel and a razor. I think someone's living there. What's going on? Fish toilet roll. Hello? Cupboard. Ooh, it's a bit spooky. Right. That shed is a listed building. I can't get in there. I'm too fat. <laughs> Let's have a look. Shed. Hello, anyone here? I've tidied it all up, removed all the needles. Apparently, there's loads of needles. And anyway, it leaves in a lot of work, but apparently, they can't touch it, it's got to be tied it up in its original form as it is. There's a lot need doing with it. Why is there a razor in there? Hello? And there's a bottle of wine on the floor. Hello? Anyone there? Down this bit, just where them bushes are. Yeah. Is a well. Is there? Yeah, there's a well there. That's, is that listed and preserved as well? No, it's a dry way, it's not what's it, because my dad used to open up the thing and shove everything. <laughs> <laughs> but no, but that, by those bushes there is actually a well. Oh, cool. Yeah. Got a lot of things in the well, isn't it? Lovely. Yeah. Yeah, well, mm, Who no, knows? don't ask. Could be some bodies yeah. down there. <laughs>